Hello and welcome back to another minion video with me, Mioni. Today I want to look at an older minion from the game, this time given to me as a gift from viewer and Patreon supporter Chris or Grimgol as you might see him comment occasionally. He made an alt to come and play with me over on Ragnarok server which is awesome. If more people want to do that you're all more than welcome. We're all going to try and do some Savage Sigma Scape eventually and some Eureka and all the other 4.2 goodness and generally enjoy the game together, so if you want to involve yourself in that, feel free to make an alt and come and join my guild. But to the point, Chris got me this dwarf rabbit minion from his adventures in-game on his alt, and as luck would have it, I actually never managed to get this one. This, if you are unfamiliar, is found rarely as a drop from the Aquapolis. That's the treasure map dungeon from dragon skin treasure maps that used to have a 50% chance of spawning after completion of that map, added in patch 3.3 back in the day in Heavensward. The rabbit is adorable and sells very highly even to this day on the market board. My own server running prices from 2 to 4 million gil easily to get one of these by buying it, or you would have to go and do Aquapolis yourself. The minion has the following text. Summon your dwarf rabbit minion. He may have a penchant for nibbling at your neighbor's garden patches. After his father was baked into a pie by a farmer's wife for stealing their vegetables, he invoked the time-honoured code of Rabbit Revenge and hopped off to destroy every garden patch he could find. The hidden text reads, But know that she who chases two rabbits catches neither one. A quote from Jamald Verbeer. The reactions this minion has to emotes are fairly sparse. He will feed from your hand with an handover emote, and a poke will get him to lift up and smell the air looking around, which is very much like what a real rabbit would do if you've ever seen one. It's a simple minion and a basic design from a time when minions were only really becoming their own thing. Heavens would really fleshed out minions in terms of the amount you could collect, and this serves as one of the more sought after from the time. Massive thanks to Chris for giving me this minion in-game and making this video possible. I thought it was worth making a video on it, and in the process I can invite all of you to possibly consider an alt over on Ragnarok server. Perhaps we can do some stuff sometime. I would love to go and play with more viewers, and that's one of the possible ways we could go about doing it. Thank you kindly for watching this video. If you liked it, or be it an old topic, please consider throwing me a like, and I will see you all next time.